Coach, tell us about the signing of your first homegrown player, young Zach Pfeffer. Zach uh, is a young man who has a lot of potential. Um, a guy who played in our academy earlier this year and trained with our first team. Um, you know, we feel like while he's young, uh, now was the time and, and discussion with his family and with Zach, um, the opportunity that we have available to him. And it just worked out. Um, and him training with the first team, he never let the level of play down. Uh, he's very technically and tactically uh, mature for his age and, and hopefully with the right path and some growth um, in, in many areas, he's going to have a bright future here. Well, we had been following the MLS and the homegrown initiative and these types of things and comparing it to what they do in Europe. And so we knew that this was the right step for him. There are certainly alternative uh, routes, if you will, through college or, th or through Europe. But this was a perfect fit for Zach. He's a local kid. It's a, a homegrown player with a, with a local team that's just starting up. It was just the right thing at the right time. And it was sort of magic. It was it was we felt um, just so right because still being 15 years old, he could still stay, um, you know, still stay around home, still stay grounded with his family, with his friends, and, you know, still have his dream, but still kind of get the normal, you know, the normal part of being a, being a teen as well. And I was very excited. It's a, it was a dream come true. And, um, uh, afterwards, me and my family, we went over to my grandparents and we had a big family dinner. I, I, was, I was excited to get, get to school, tell my friends, my brother's, my brother's be, becoming a professional soccer player because I know that's what he's wanted for the, since we've started playing soccer. He's always watched professional games and has been like, I want to be out there. The match for your Philadelphia Union, number 16. Michael Orozco Fiscal. Now entering the match, number 27, Zach Pfeffer. How this big was it for Zach to play at age 15 in that exhibition game against Chivas of Guadalajara in a Philadelphia Union uniform? That was pretty special, I think. Uh, it was special for all of us. For, to have a kid who's in your academy and then you want to give him the opportunity to train with the first team is one thing. Uh, when he trained with us, he certainly didn't let the level down. And for the coaching staff, he proved that he belonged. Um, so that was an opportunity, the last opportunity we were going to have to make sure that we rewarded him a little bit. And that's what that was. He came out to the car and he was a little, I want to say, not nervous, but maybe, I don't know, shocked that um, when they were sitting as a team. Um, I guess Coach Nowak said that everybody was going to get in and even Pfeffer was going to get to step on the field. And that's kind of when the whole um, preparation for the next day started. He was a little nervous and we're, we were trying to tell him, you're, you're going you're gonna to be fine, you're going to do great. Um, even though we were really, really nervous. Is he going to play well? Is he going to do all right? Well, it actually started at training the day before the game. Uh, Coach Nowak brought all of us uh, together at the end of training and, um, and said that everyone was going to get into the game and he said that even I would get some time too. So um, after that I talked to my parents. They were, uh, they were all surprised. I was very surprised and also excited. A few minutes in the second half I started to warm up and um, I actually became more excited. Most of the nerves went away as I started to warm up and um, once I put on that jersey and came up to the came up to midfield to enter the game it was I was excited and I got right into it when the game came I, I was really excited I, I was I was going crazy in the stands when they announced that he was coming on the field all of my friends were there we were all supporting him my mom was crying everybody knew about it and uh, it had a was lot of friends there of friends. family and you know in retrospect it's sort of an emotional circle that we've come through from the beginning when we first saw him play soccer and we kind of knew what he was all about and what he wanted out of his life and to finally see him <clears throat> get onto a professional field and play in such a capacity it was just a fabulous feeling of joy and a feeling that this is where he belongs he is the kind of player but also the kind of person who very clearly stated i want to be a pro this is my goal and aspiration 
you know, he, he's a bright kid off the field too. He's extremely academic. Um, he's not going to throw away his education at the same time. He'll continue that. Um, but he knew what he wanted right from the start. When you find a player like that who has um, the potential, the talent that he has, uh, then this kind of opportunity is one that will allow him to hopefully reach his goals. Uh, I think the Philadelphia Union fans are the best fans in the league, and uh, every game, you know, the atmosphere is electric. It's a wonderful stadium to play in, and uh, I'm very excited to play in there in the next few years.